What's going on out there, everybody? It's Roll Easy here, and I'm back with another Money Glitch video for you guys. And we got a lot to talk about in this video because they have patched up a lot of stuff, all right? We got a bunch of new, you know, content here for Christmas. We, I do believe we got some new clothing. Uh, if you look at your MOCs, you actually have, you know, lighting and stuff in your MOCs inside the Avenger. You got Christmas lights. If you go in your apartments, you got Christmas trees. You got things like that, all right? So, uh, a lot of new content did come in, a couple new cars also, I believe, but we're here to talk about money glitches. So, what's working, what's not working, you know, what's been patched today? Wh well, last night, as many of you know, I posted the unlimited money glitch, the solo money glitch for the Orbital Cannon, okay? That's the one where you can get $500,000 pretty much, you know, every two minutes. That has been patched. That got patched like first thing in the morning, all right? They wanted to get rid of that, so... You guys that you were begging me for solo glitches, that was the solo money glitch to do. I'm sorry if you weren't able to do it. There will probably be more in the future, but for now, that was probably the best solo money glitch you were going to get, alright, in a long, long time. Alright, uh, secondly, we're going to move over to the duplication glitch that Bruntango and Boca Boy posted. That one has also been patched. Now, when you go into your Avenger and you accept those CEO invites, and you know, you're supposed to accept the CEO invite from your friend, and uh, spam on exit Avenger and when you exit and you hit the black screen that's when you tell your friend go ahead and retire now once that happens once you retire you should be spawning into your friends uh, facility that is not happening anymore you are spawning outside every single time so that one has been fully patched if you can't spawn in your friends facility then you guys can't be duplicating cars now I know he's working uh, for you know he's trying to get a workaround uh, going on for that but for now that is patched which also means the, uh, the Avenger duplication glitch that me and BMX found that I posted last night as well, that got patched as well because we need to be spawning in our friend's, you know, facility for that. So the only money glitch that's working right now is the money glitch that BMX and I found, the duplication glitch, the retro one. You can duplicate any car with this. That's the gameplay you're seeing now. Rockstar tried to patch it. Uh, some people are saying they can still press right D-pad and pause. It's 100% patched for me and my friends. We cannot press right D-pad and then pause. Pause does not come up. Uh, it just drives us into the MOC. So we do have a workaround for you. This is the workaround. Me and BMX just figured this out today. And also special shout out to True GTA as well. What you're going to need is one friend. You both need MOCs with the personal vehicle storage. Very important. Your friend just needs any personal vehicle in there. You want an LG RH8 in there, and you do not need custom plates. The LG RH8 plate will transfer over to your retro dupe or whatever you're duping. And uh, yeah, take out a retro or a Benny's vehicle so that you can dupe and just put it out there on the street. That's all you want to do. Now, this method is mainly for Xbox. I'm not going to lie. So once I get some info on a you know clear-cut PS4 method, I will link that down in the description and the pinned comment. All right, so... This is what you want to do. Make sure that you get the drive-in animation. This is the perspective of the helper. All right. So remember, PS4 guys, stay tuned unless you have a PS4 Pro controller. If you have a PS4 Pro controller, then you can probably do this. But the old PS4 controllers, I don't believe can do this method right here. All right. So this is what you want to do now. So this is the this is me. I'm the helper. BMX. He's the duper. That's the car he's going to be duping. That's out on the street right now. Okay. So he hopped into the passenger seat. What he's gonna do is first, I'm gonna drive up. This is the car that was in my MOC. I'm gonna, you know, wait. I'm gonna tell him I can hit right D pad. He's gonna go ahead and switch to grenades. And he is gonna actually throw uh, a grenade or two. I recommend two, you know, maybe more alongside the MOC, the right side. Now, what I'm gonna do is right when that grenade leaves his hand, I'm gonna start pressing the desync button at the top of my Xbox controller and then right D pad. So you see that my controller was disconnected. That's what we're doing now, actually, guys, to get the, uh, instead of the pause menu to come up because the pause is, isn't working anymore for most of us, I'm actually pressing desync and then I'm spamming right D-pad pretty much. You can hold right D-pad if you want. Now, you might fail sometimes when you reconnect. Uh, if you're just driving right back in and your friend's in there with you, then that means it didn't work. Grenades sometimes, guys, are not exploding now. Okay, so that is a problem. Uh, for some reason with this method, the grenades are not exploding a lot. I think it's part of the patch that they were screwing with. Okay, so I actually recommend that you park your MOC, you know, in like high traffic, basically, like in the middle of the street when doing this. You'll see on the other successful attempt where we're actually going to be parked. That's the essential place you want to be parked in the middle of like an intersection or something. So here's a successful attempt. So remember, I'm the helper. I'm driving. This is my MOC. He is the duper. He has his car outside ready to do. 
So what he is gonna do is he's gonna go ahead and toss two grenades out of the uh, right side, uh, on, you know, onto the right side of the MOC, and I already have my finger on the desync button. So right now, boom, I'm gonna press desync and hold it, and I'm gonna press right D-pad very shortly after, all right? Now what should happen is you stay on this alert screen. Those grenades should explode. I'd say stay like five to like, you know, 10 seconds on here. Just sit on this alert screen. Then go ahead and resync your controller back. Okay, resync your controller, and when you resync your controller, you might get auto sucked in, or you might just, you know, be out there anyways. Go in. If you did it successfully, your friend will be kicked out of the car and he'll be invisible. If that's the case, he needs to like, hop into his car once you drive into your MOC, and then go ahead and leave the session. If done correctly, while he's in his car and you leave the session, just like before, he's gonna get a black screen and he's gonna go ahead and spawn in his dupe with the brand new plate from the RH8 that was in his inside his MOC. Okay, so that was the perspective of the helper. Now this is the duper. This is me getting the car. This is what it looks like once you get the car. So I wanted you to see what the helper is actually doing now. The helper needs to desync their controller and uh, hit right D-pad. So if you got confused, you know, go back and rewatch that part of the video, guys. Okay, so I'm the duper this time. This is his MOC. This is his car from inside his MOC, and my retro is sitting out there waiting. So check it out. So now I'm the duper this time. I want to dupe a car. So I'm going to go ahead and have my grenades out. Look where we're parked. We're parked in the middle of the street for like double the chance because if a car hits you, same thing will happen, all right? It'll kick you off and you'll be invisible. All right, so here we go. So I'm going to go ahead and toss a couple of grenades right here. So I toss one. Right away, he's going to hold the desync button and press right D-pad. He's actually going to spam right D-pad. So he's holding desync. He's spamming right D-pad. Those bombs are going to explode or somebody's going to crash into us. All right. One or the other will happen. Okay. That's why I recommend parking in the street. So check it out. The bombs exploded. I got kicked out and I'm invisible. Now he can go ahead and resync his controller. So he's resyncing his controller and he's driving into his MOC. Only when he drives into his MOC can I then hop into my retro. All right. That's very important. So now you see I'm hopping into my car. He's inside his MOC. I'm telling him, go ahead and leave. All right. He's going to go ahead and leave the session. So watch. You saw that I had the roll easy plate on there. Remember, you don't need custom plates for this. I spawned back. He's left the session and I got the brand new plate that was on the RH8 inside my MOC. That's how you got to do it now, guys. No more right D-pad start. Uh, some people are saying it's still working for them. But like I said, for us, that's 100% patched. We cannot press right D-pad and start anymore. Just the start menu does not come up whatsoever. It's non-existent. There's no lag, nothing like that. So that's the new way to do it, guys. Uh, like I said, a PS4 method. And right now, remember, this car isn't saved yet. It's still technically an RH8. It's still The game still technically thinks it's the RH8 that's inside my MOC. All right. Remember, no custom plates. That's why the plate from the RH8 in my MOC is what got transferred over here. So now I need to go up and request my MOC. You could have it on the map beforehand if you really want to. But now all I got to do is go ahead and drive it back over to my MOC and drive it in there to fully, fully save it. Okay. So, uh, yeah, if you try to switch sessions right now or anything like that, the car will just revert right back to an RH8. If you try to drive it into a garage, anything like that, uh, LSC it won't even let you in there. A garage it might let you in there but it'll just revert it back to an rh8 simple as that so this is what you need to do get your moc out and drive it in there before you change sessions or do whatever you want okay so as you can see right here i'm gonna hit right d-pad and then here we go the car is being saved now now like i said with the with the controller method ps4 you guys on the regular ps4 controllers and the older ones I don't think you guys have the resync or, and desync buttons or anything on there. I don't think you guys can yank, you know, plugs or anything like that. So this is mainly for Xbox users and anybody on PS4 that has the PS4 Pro controllers. All right, PS4 Pro controllers I know can do this. Now, once I get some information on other PS4 methods, you know, other videos say that people have come out with or other tutorials that people have, I will definitely link them in the description and the pinned comment for you PS4 guys so you guys can take advantage of this. This is the only working money glitch. Shout out to BMX and myself and as well as True GTA 5 because this is the only one that has, you know, lived through it and that we already have a workaround for literally the day of the patch. All right. We figured this out today. We wanted to bring it to you guys so that you guys can keep making your money. Even though there were a lot of glitches last night, I was hoping, I hoped you guys, you know, took advantage of all those glitches and made your money because that was the time, man. That was the best solo money glitch we've had in such a, such a long time, straight up. So, um, yeah, I think that's going to be it for me, guys. Uh, you know, money glitch information will always be down in the description and the pinned comment as well. As always, thank you for all your support. 
Uh, my name is Roll Easy. Make sure everybody that's new to the channel, you know, press that big red subscribe button. Uh, turn on post notifications if you're new as well. And, uh, you know, drop a fat like on this video, guys. We already got a workaround for the patch that they put in today. So you guys can still make money right now. And, uh, yeah, so that's going to be it. And, uh, yeah, I guess peace out, guys. Always tune in for the freshest and the most informative dope GTA 5 online content. Take it easy.